Hey guys, my name is Khada Atfaki. I'm a clinical health psychology master's student at Queen's University, Belfast. And today I'll be going to London for a short trip before I go back home. The one thing I love the most is to travel either very early in the morning or late at night to really indulge in the whole day and kind of win it, you know? So here I'm just uh, waiting to board my flight. Hey guys, so I just touched down in London. The flight took approximately an hour and 50 minutes, maybe 30 minutes. It was very smooth. It passed by so quickly and I'm on my way to get my luggage. If you're not aware, um, because we carry a student visa that belongs to the UK, we don't need to pass the border when we land in London, or in England in fact. So, um, this is the airport, it's quite quiet right now, and I'm super excited, I'm gonna see my best friend. In London, Ubers are very reliable, so I took an Uber, dropped my bag in Oxbridge, which is around 30 minutes away from Heathrow, and then we took the tube and found ourselves at Baker Street so we could eventually go to Hammersmith. Right across, you see Madame Tussauds, which is a wax museum, very known. Just to give you a quick rundown, I met with my best friend, we had brunch and then headed to South Ridges where we shopped, grabbed coffee, relaxed a bit and then we took the bus to, to Victoria Street and um, we're at Fight Club now, meeting my other friends. So here we're at Fight Club. As you can see, this is their beautiful outdoor space with several booths where you can sit with other people. And inside they have very nice interior and dart boards for you to play darts. Very, very fun. They also have great drinks and very good food. But honestly, I was drained from all the traveling. So today is my travel day to go back to Lebanon, but as I'm staying in Oxbridge, I decided to take the train and go to Kingston to visit my family before going into London and meeting my best friend to spend the rest of the day. Despite the very high volume of people that are present in London, I can safely say that using the tube and public transportation is very convenient. We found ourselves in Soho where we had lunch, roamed around, and did some shopping. Then we walked to Regent Street and Mayfair, and I decided on my way back to Oxbridge to pass by Ealing to see my friends that we went to Fight Club with yesterday before I head to the airport. These two days were very interesting in London, and very enjoyable. For me, coming back home means seeing family, spending time with them, running errands, and the most important thing, my car driving. And fun fact, they say once you know how to drive in Lebanon, you can drive anywhere else in the world because of how chaotic driving is. The rest of the day I spent it with my grandma and my cousins before I headed to the mountains and watched this amazing sunset. I'm not gonna bother you with all the details of all my days in Lebanon. What I will do is tell you a brief recap. So, of course, I had a mini makeover by cutting my hair and feeling rejuvenated. I had a wedding and I went on a getaway with my best friend uh, to Betroun and it's by the seaside. We had an event. We seen such nice sunsets as you would see and one of the highlights of my trip as well was going on a hiking trip to my favorite place on planet earth Erzil Baruch and um, we also had such great Manaish which is uh, basically a flatbread that has some cheese or thyme, za'atar or kashik which is a type of uh, dried goat's milk and I revisited my university, AUB, before I headed back to London 
to also spend time with my aunt before heading back to Belfast. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you enjoyed it.